hi everybody welcome to my youtube video channel so today i'm going to cover most of the things about glomerulus very simple way the nephron is the microscopic structural and functional unit of the kidney it consists of the renal corpuscle and renal tubule renal corpuscle consists of glomerulus and bowman capsule each kidney has approximately 1 million nephrons Blood supply to the kidney is from the renal artery, which is divided into many branches in the kidney. Please watch our video about nephron to get a clear idea of blood supply to the kidney. Afferent arteriole brings blood to the glomerulus, then blood filters through the glomerulus. Efferent arteriole carries blood away from the glomerulus. The diameter of the efferent arteriole is larger than the efferent arteriole. Capillary endothelium and epithelium of the capsule separate the blood from the glomerular filtrate. Capillary endothelium is fenestrated with pores. It is surrounded by the glomerular basement membrane along with podocyte, which cause to form filtration slate. Blood filters through the cellular layers and filter into Bowman space. Then filtrate enter into the proximal convoluted tubules. The proximal convoluted tubule is made up of a single layer of cells. The luminal edge of the cell having many microvilli leads to form brush border. There are two layers in the renal corpuscle, which are visceral layer and parietal layer. Podocytes and pedicles make the visceral layer. Space between these two layers is Bowman space. We can find another type of specialized cells called mesangial cells are located between the basal lamina and endothelium. Mesangial cells are especially common between two neighboring capillaries. The mesangial cells have an ability to contract and involve the regulation of glomerular filtration rate. Also, it plays a role in glomerular diseases. The granular cells, macula densa, and mesangium extraglomerular cells constitute the juxtaglomerular apparatus. The secretory granules in granular cells have been shown to contain renin. The thick end of the ascending limb of loop of Henle reaches the glomerulus of the nephron and starts distal convoluted tubule at the macula densa. In this video, I briefly discuss the glomerulus. You can get a clear idea about nephron by watching our next video. Please share and like this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notifications of our new videos.